Okay, so considering that this episode is all about science experiments, I decided to take on an experiment of my own. Recently, I've been trying to get my hands on a lava lamp, but I was thinking, wouldn't it be better to make one? Oh, and if you're gonna try this at home, have your parents on hand to help you out. Things might get a bit messy. Here's what I'll need. One clear jar or bottle with a lid, some food coloring, some uh, glitter for a little extra pizzazz, some vegetable oil, salt, and last but not least, water. Oh, and uh, don't forget a flashlight. You're gonna light this thing up somehow, right? All right, to get started, I'm gonna fill the jar with water until it's about three quarters full. All right, that looks about right. Now I'm gonna add a few drops of food coloring. Well, uh, I just added a bit too much there, so remember, a few drops of food coloring can go a long way, so don't go crazy with it. Otherwise, you end up with that. Let's start over. And I'm really going for that extra sparkle, so in goes a pinch of glitter. I'm gonna take this vegetable oil and fill the jar until it's almost full and wait for the water and oil to separate. And now it's time to pour some salt into the jar and I'm gonna keep adding the salt until the bubbles start moving around and we get that cool lava lamp effect. Now that we got those bubbles moving around, it's time to hit the lights. Voila, that's pretty cool. So, what's the secret you ask? Science, of course. Basically, oil is much lighter or less dense than water, and this means that oil will rise to the surface when the two are mixed. On the other hand, salt is much heavier or more dense than water, and this means that salt will sink to the bottom. When you add the salt to your water and oil mixture, salt attaches to the oil blobs, making them heavy and causing the oil to sink to the bottom of the jar with the salt. Once the salt dissolves, the oil returns to the top. And there you go, you got yourself a homemade lava lamp. Not bad, right? Okay, so let's get back to some more cool science experiment videos, this time featuring Eggs.